So today I just want to make sure you guys are understanding the difference between non-point source and point source solution pollutants. They're a little bit confusing, so we're going to go over non-point sources uh, first. So as you guys can see in this drawing, we have suburban development, city streets, rural homes, and croplands, and animal feedlots. These are all sources of non-point non-point source pollutions. Um, what I want you guys to know about non-point source pollutants is that they are very hard to uh, identify. Um, you know, they come from many different places. Uh, it's things that you know accumulate over time, and they're very hard to control. For example, on this cropland over here, you have um, fertilizers being put down. When we get a heavy enough rain, the fertilizers will travel from up here, and the rain event will push them all down into the water. But this doesn't happen with just any one cropland. It happens with all of them. So it's hard to say, you know, which cropland is putting more fertilizer in than others. Um, it's very difficult to figure out. Or for example, with, uh, you know, rural homes or city streets, suburban developments. In the wintertime, we get ice on our roads. Uh, so what we do is we put down the road salt, which um, is not very good for our water. And we'll put road salt down everywhere, and then once we get, you know, a big heavy rain or the snow starts to melt, it'll all eventually make its way into the water. And we can knew, know this by doing, you know, tests on the water chemistry. However, it's not, we're not able to say, you know, well, New York City produced this much road salt, or, um, you know, got this first road salt into the water, or, you know, the suburban de development, you know, over in Ramapo, they were responsible for, you know, a hundred tons of uh, road salt getting in the water. It's just, you can't say that. It's not um, quantifiable once it's in the water. We just know how much is in there. We, we don't know where exactly it came from. Next, we're going to talk about point source pollution.